Hello friends, welcome to Surya Engineering Exam. Today we are going to see the problem related with wastewater engineering in the topic of uh, conventional activated sludge treatment process. So the problem is an activated operating data for conventional activated sludge treatment plant is follows. So wastewater flow is 35,000 meter cube per day. Volume of aeration tank is 10,900 m cube. Influent BOD 250 mg per liter, effluent BOD 20 mg per liter, MLSS 2500 mg per liter, then uh, effluent suspended solids is 30 mg per liter, waste sea waste suspended solids 9700 mg per liter, then quantity of waste sludge is 220 mg per day. Okay, so we have to find out, determine aeration period in hours, then FM ratio, F by foot by microbial mass ratio, then uh, efficiency of BOD removal, then sludge age. Okay, so these are all the things we have to find out. So first thing is given value. So given the Q value is 35,000 MQ per day, so then why not so that is uh, influent BOD is uh, 250 milligram per liter then volume of aeration tank V equal to 10,900 m cube so then uh, XT that is uh, MLSS that is 2,500 m milligram per liter then XE XE is uh, effluent suspended solids that is 30 milligram per liter then uh, ye that is effluent bod is 20 milligram per liter then qr equal to 9700 milligram per liter then qw equal to 220 meter cube per day so these are all the things we uh, they are given so we have to find out first thing we have to find out the aeration period in 24 hours so the formulas for aeration period aeration period t equal to v by q into 24 hours okay so now we can take 10900 divided by 35,000 into 24 hours so we got the value of 7.47 that is 7.5 hours so this is the first question answer second thing is uh, foot by microbial ratio so then F equal to Q into Y naught that is 35,000 into 250 so we can convert into kg per day so we can put 1000 so 1000 kg is equal to 1 m cube so that is 8750 kg per day okay likewise we can calculate the m value so m equal to v into xt that is v equal to 10900 into xt value is again 2500 divided by we can convert into kg so divided by 1000 equal to 27,250 kg okay so now we can easily find out the foot by microbial ratio that is uh, f by m ratio so now foot by microbial ratio so now f by m so f we found out 8750 then m 27250 so solving this we got the value 0 0.32 Okay, so third question efficiency of BOD removal. So now the formula is incoming BOD minus outgoing BOD divided by incoming BOD. So incoming BOD is 250 and outgoing BOD is 20. So 250 minus 20 divided by 250 into 100. So now we got the value of 92 percentage. So fourth question is sludge age. So we know the formula theta c equal to xt into v divided by qw into xr plus q minus qw into xc okay so now we know all the values so now we can substitute all the values over here so xt equal to 2500 that is given into the volume is uh, 10900 divided by 1000 so divided by qw 220 into 9700 divided by 100 
plus if the Q value is 3, 35,000. So 35,000 minus QW is 220 divided by 100 into X e is 30. Okay, solving this we got the value of theta C equal to 8.52 days. So this is a sludge age. Okay, so this is a method we can solve the problem. Again, we will see next video. Thank you.